Hi there, this is Trinity Ranganathan here, marketing legend. Welcome to a mind blowing course on virtual humans, digital mind cloning tools of 2019, right? Uh, now, um, like when I was working in a lot of international companies back there in three years back, then, right, I came to, you know, stumble upon some technology which can change the world, right? And this is virtual humans and digital mind cloning tools. The first of its kind in the world itself, right? So typically, when you talk about immortality, being, you know, immortal as a digital clone, this has been, you know, kind of a dream um, since ancient times, you know, even from China, uh, it has it has come over to Japan, India, right? And there has been a long time quest um, on you know transforming this mind cloning dream into a great reality, right? And some even futurists believe that humans uh, will be able to achieve digital immortality, right? By uploading their minds uh, to the computers or PC by in the year say 2020, uh, sorry 25 or 30 or something like that, right? And it's just where digital mind clones come into existence right now and this has uh, the entire power to change um, how humans think and feel and how we can interact uh, with digital avatars right so how does this work let's see it right now before you start enrolling in this course this is a must you gotta watch right you know people might say digital mind cloning is not even possible it's not real and all this stuff but I say that we have evolved completely as humans right to experience this technology of the future which is called as mind cloning and you know say how this technology can change the entire universe is what this course is uh, where we are going to discuss all the stuff here and we are going to completely remove the barriers where you say that this is not even possible guys this is completely possible i mean it and you will also believe the same after the end of this course so what is the difference between a digital mind clone uh, and the real human we always store our thoughts and feelings in the particular mind files where the mind cloning tools will take care of those files right and they are starting to do uh, for example they go starting to help you discover all these things where you're going to talk to your own clone your own digital clone and you're going to store your memories your feelings your thoughts uh, vice versa and it's going to answer uh, those uh, from there right for example somebody or maybe uh, after 10 years or 20 years um, your kid can ask questions uh, maybe you're not there after 10 years right your digital clone will still live on and uh, that is this amazing amazing thing that feeling and experiencing that your model is kind of uh, the mind-blowing thing right so this course is uh, a great course that will help you to you know create your own digital clone mind clone and how you're able to use that to your max potential is up to you right the only difference in this technology it's not it's this technology is called virtual cloning like digital cloning right and this uh, will help you to you know grab that eternal uh, secret of immortality to virtual clones right and um, yeah you can uh, live forever as a digital clone mind you and this is the great benefit of taking this course the three reasons that you got to look at while you take this course number one is you'll be able to create a digital clone of yourself like if you watch the movie her htr you'll be able to uh, see how a digital clone um, uh, is created in in the form of um, a computer software right so it's something similar to that you'll be able to do okay the next thing you'll be able to preserve your memories forever for your kids and their kids for accessing them in the future for you know say hundreds of years and the third thing is you'll be able to embed your training skills uh, to that particular you know say digital clone that you created right and this can go on to even um, be accessed by others maybe your students or maybe someone uh, who wants to access uh, or some bit of information from that particular clone can chat with the clone and get that information right we'll be looking at some softwares uh, practically we'll be looking at some software that'll be teaching for this purpose right so this is kind of the disruption that you're looking at right now in your on your screens so let's talk about what is called as WBE which is called as um, the definition for that is something like 
old brain emulation or you call it mind uploading right you copy those mental content uh, this includes your long-term memory also to a device it can be kind of a computer or an app or maybe it's it's a game or something like that right when you store it uh, in that particular app or tool or whatever it is uh, you and it is going to operate with neural networks with artificial intelligence neural networks this whole process uh, is called as WB and it's not a futuristic concept it exists guys the WB exists right now and these tools what I'm going to teach are those tools which has this WB, uh, uh, you know, process embedded with them, where you store those mind files or, you know, your thoughts, the emotions, the sentences that you need to, you know, store. Um, this exists completely. It is not a futuristic concept. Uh, some scientists say that's a futuristic concept. I say it's not. It exists right now in the spot, right? So uh, imagine the time when you'll be able to transfer your memories onto the cloud tool, right? This time is right now, guys. You got to take a backup of everything that you want uh, and you got to store it because it's the time, right? The right time is now. The future is now. That's what we call it, right? This mind transfer, this thoughts transfer, this emotions transfer has to be done right now. And welcome to the future, by the way. <laughs> Okay, um, so Bina48 uh, is a breakthrough intelligence via Neural Architecture 48, uh, which is called as a kind of a, a sentient robot, uh, an android, it can be a social robot for that matter, right? It can talk to you, it can converse with you, right? Uh, it is uh, said that it has been owned by um, Martin Roth uh, Blot's, uh, you know, say, Teresa Movement. Correct. So it has been a great experiment and the future of, you know, say mind uploading has been, uh, you know, implemented there, by the way. Right. And um, yeah, so your assignment for today before we even start the course is to Google B.I.N.A. 48 guys. And uh, it is uh, said that it has memories, it, it, the feelings and memories are stored of a real human there. And you got to check it out all right this is kind of um uh, the ultimate game changer when it comes uh to um you know say mind cloning or digital mind cloning in the form of even a human you know say a robot that takes place here right now okay and uh, binia 48 right is also the first uh robot to co-teach a university class right and at West Point, the U.S. Military Academy, right, uh, it taught a class uh, on philosophy, right, and, uh, you know, it was, uh, the topics were from ethics to war theory and usage of artificial intelligence in society. And after it finished, right, <laughs> there were also uh, students asking for questions uh, that they thought uh, were, you know, kind of, um, you know, that they had, they were curious to know about stuff and Bina48 even answered those. So it's kind of a mind-blowing experience, right? When you see a clone, a robot clone talking to you and uh, answering, uh, you know, your mm, questions, it, it, it's, it's a great experience that cannot be explained, uh, you know, by anyone out here, right? Uh, it's kind of an experience that is unforgettable uh, for that matter. Okay, now I think you're all set to learn this course on mind cloning and you're going to explore the tools to the fullest potential out here and you're going to rock, rock the stage with your digital clone forever. Let's get ready.